but I've seen this thing on the internet a lot that British people eat cheese sandwiches with this weird item. So I went over to this store and I picked up Branston Original Pickle. It's, uh, we're gonna go home and open it up, but apparently you're supposed to, perfect partner to live up your cheese sandwich or cheese board. So, uh, this is Ryan, a uh, chowin' British food. Here we go, I got a nice English Gloucester cheese, uh, some margarine, yeah, some pickled onions, some bread, and some Branston pickle, and we'll finish it off with chocolate-covered digestive cookies. On the nose meat, it is gluten-free, it's very good bread. All right, we'll toast it up. All right, Branston pickle, let's uh, go in for a smell. Never had this before in my life. It's like barbecue sauce. Kind of chunky, it has nothing to do with what we consider North American cucumber pickles. Kind of looks more like a, a chutney. See, it's chunky. The hell is that? Kind of like HP sauce and veggies or something. Okay, so we'll liberally put on this and then lay some uh, real British sharp cheddar, a cheese sandwich. Okay. And now for the special, the special guy, uh, I don't know, how much do I add? Is that enough? Branston pickle. It's got a rutabaga, carrot, onion, cauliflower. All right, here we go. There it is, the Branston pickle sandwich. Guess we'll go in for a bite. Classic. Hmm. Try another bite. Hmm. The pickles are they're crunchy. They're um, it's kind of nice. I'm gonna. I know I'm not supposed to. Got a good smoky flavor. Nothing like we really have here in North America. And it does taste good in a cheese sandwich. I don't know how often I would buy it, but it was $8 Canadian. But honestly, a Branston and cheese pickle sandwich, I give this an 8 out of 10. This is Ryan Eaton. Branston pickle from UK. Chowing down. Let's review. British Digestive Chocolate Cookies. Nah.